Atomic Times. It is an honor to be asked to work on this edition and continue the important tradition of yearly revision. Much of What Color Is Your Parachute is written in the first person, so throughout this book you will hear the word I. Sometimes it will refer to Richard Bowles, sometimes to me. Most of the time, it doesn't matter. Where the ownership of the statement is significant, statements will clearly be attributed to either Richard Bowles or Catherine Brooks. What I love about the parachute approach is the level playing field it provides for all job seekers in every employment sector. In Richard's writings, you hear his timeless advice and wisdom in action, his compassion and respect for all workers, his emphasis on the importance of choosing your career and not letting the job market choose it for you, his encouragement to take the time to do a thorough self-evaluation before hitting the job market, and his belief in the importance of all careers, from pipe fitters to harp builders to doctors. With his usual aplomb, he deconstructed the holy grail of every job seeker, a job that fits your passions and fulfills your life mission. And he was quite transparent, practical, and honest in his approach to that search. On the top of my computer, I have a sticker that reads, This isn't career development. This is rocket fuel. Well, Richard and I don't have a rocket, but we do have a parachute to offer you, a way to land efficiently and happily in this crazy, messy landscape we call the job market. Safe and fulfilling journeys to you all. Catherine Kate Brooks Go and get your things, he said. Dreams mean work. Paulo Coelho Chapter 1 Welcome to the ever-changing world of the job search. If you are trying to better understand yourself and what you have to offer to the world, this book is for you. If the recent turmoil created by the COVID-19 virus has impacted your work situation, this book is for you. If you are out of work and want practical help, this book is for you. If you're trying to understand how the world, and particularly the world of work, really works these days, this book is for you. If you've been out of work a long time and you think you're now permanently unemployable, this book is for you. If you're on the edge of poverty these days, this book is for you. If you're dealing with a disability, this book is for you. If you're trying to figure out a new career or your first career, this book is for you. If you're trying to figure out what you want to do next with your life, this book is for you. If you're trying to find a better work-life balance, this book is for you. If you're stuck in your role and need a way out, this book is for you. If you're just graduating from college and have to live with your parents because you can't find any work, this book is for you. If you're trying to start your own business, this book is for you. If you're a returning vet, this book is for you. If you're facing retirement and want to know what to do to support yourself, this book is for you. A Quick Crash Course on the World of Work Job markets are fickle. For some people, a lot of people, the past few years have been a great economic period with lots of opportunities. But recent developments related to COVID-19 changed the employment landscape for many industries. Even without the health-related impact, industries and jobs are changing rapidly. Depending on your career field, you may find lots of opportunities or very few. The process of finding a job seems overwhelming. Many a job seeker says, Out of work, made up a resume, sent it to all the places I'm supposed to, went to all the internet job boards and looked for vacancies in my field day after day, week.